Hello! It's me, Tailmange here, and I'm back here playing Silent Hunter 3. I know lots of you have been requesting this and wanting more Silent Hunter 3. I apologise that I haven't been playing it so much, but I'm playing it now, so hopefully some action will happen that I can upload. Um, so far, nothing. I've been patrolling around outside Karachi for the last few days. The date is now December the 1st, 1943. And um, I've decided to try my look over here in the Gulf von Oman, near to the Strasse von Hormuz, near to the Persische Gulf, just to see if I can find anything over here. If not, then it might be time to start on my way around India. Maybe stop off around here in Madras or Trinko Mali, just to see if there's anything there. And then it's onwards to my final destination, Penang. And then after Penang, who knows where? Australia, probably. We'll have to see what's going on around here. Maybe we can go... No, we can't go to Hawaii. That's too far. Um, we can visit Japan. <laughs> no. Um, I guess we probably... I don't know. We've probably got enough fuel to visit Japan, if we really wanted to. That there's nothing here. And that would be a long journey. Right, um, yeah, so that was that, my little update, um, just to tell you where we are. Um, so hopefully, Gunter Gatner and the crew of U-124 will uh, have something to shoot at fairly soon. If not, then nothing will be uploaded, apart from this sorry introduction to a video, which almost doesn't exist. Anyway, um... I'll pop back when something interesting happens or otherwise with some kind of boring report on what's not happened. So, see you then. We have seen a Flugzeug! Uh, uh, let's engage it. Why not? Gives us something to do. So hopefully we don't die. Um, so this at least gives me something to upload for you. As you can see, it's now daytime. Uh, the date is now December the 3rd. Local time, 11 a.m. Here comes the Flugzeug. Let's have a look at it. Here it is. What a beast. I don't know if we can do anything to this with our puny flag gun, but we shall soon see. We're heading straight, pretty much straight forward. Let's turn southwards. Let's give our flat gun and go there. <clears throat> Aim. Where is it? 43. There she is. Engage that target. be firing from it too long range but uh, by the time he's reloaded should be a bit closer here we go oh boy, that's a good idea oh we've hit it and he's shooting at us come on oh a bit flew off it Oh my god. Please don't hurt me. Ah, oh, that was rubbish. Naughty Flutoid. You're not very good at your job. Oh my god. I'm at, it looks like I'm flying that thing. Is he going down? I think he's going down. Oh dear. So much for the Flugzeug. <laughs> yeah! Boom! Are there any sharks in the Arabian Sea? I hope not, for their sake, if they survived. 
Although we're apparently damaged. Oh, there it is. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Propeller still spinning. Crew still on board. On a journey to the deep. I guess I better take a look at the damage here. What's the, what's the situation here? Hmm? Hmm? What's wrong? I think it's just uh, hull damage. We've taken rather than anything else. Did I switch off the hull damage indicator? Perhaps I did. I can't remember. But the thing appears to be majorly wrong. So, great. Okay. Well, that was pretty good. We killed a Flugzeug. One less Flugzeug to trouble us. Well, at least this gives me something to upload then. Uh, excellent. So we'll continue on our journey. I'll take this flat guy off the... Uh, oops. There. There we go. Go in there. Good. Okay. It's all good. You need to rest. There. Great. So we'll continue on my patrol here and see if we can spot any actual ships to shoot. Or perhaps we'll have another encounter with a Flugzeug. Only time will tell. Whoa! Well, isn't this a turn up for the box? We have a radio report of an enemy convoy heading straight for us. That's fantastic. Okay then. This was a good place to be, it seems. Now then, let's see if we can work out the rough direction here. Look, exactly where I am right now. That's incredible. Okay, um, what I'm going to do... Let's have a bit of a zigzag course along this route until we come into contact with them and then we shall see what we shall see surface the boat is it seeing radar signals oh god oh this is them already wow how far away are they 20 kilometers well then no need for the zigzags we all we need to do really is kind of head towards them a bit. I'll mark this here. That's yeah, that's the lead ship. Yeah, and there's another one. Okay, time to go to periscope depth, I think. I'll see you again. What's the time? We're getting into night time, which is excellent. This is about the most perfectest, perfect thing I could have asked for at this moment. All this waiting appears to finally, finally born fruit. And not just any old fruit. Sausage fruit. And bananas. All right. So I'm going under here. The ships are this away. That's where our date with destiny will be. Okay, let's speed things up a little bit. Hopefully we'll pick them up on the hydrophone pretty soon. Basically dead ahead of us right now. Oops. Yeah, and the hydrophones are now in action. Okay, now I think large convoys aren't really this type of U-boat's forte, so to speak. Good silent running, just in case. Now then, what shall I do here? Schleifer. I don't know if I'll be able to get a, a visual on them yet. Weather is pretty good, I think. Visibility is pretty good. 
Very little wind. But they're probably still too far away to see. I'm wondering whether to try and wait in front of the convoy, let them pass over me, hopefully not be detected, and then I can fire from within the convoy, from both my uh, bow and stern tubes, or the, op or the uh, option is to kind of move out to the side, and attack from a uh, side, but then the juicy ships tend to be in the middle of the convoy, so I think I'm going to try the former method. Here comes the lead escort, probably doing a forward uh, kind of sweep. So he is very, very close to us, so we can probably see him. Ah, here we go, so there's all the merchants. There's the escort. Is that it? Could be. What do we have here? Just move the microphone so I can get a bit closer to the screen. Ah, we are kind of already on the sides of the convoy. Which is not ideal. Okay. Looks like there's only two lines, which is a bit odd. Um, what I'm going to do... Let's kind of head southwards a bit. So I can get a good shot on these guys. I'm a bit too close right now, I think. Especially to this line of ships here. move away from them give me enough time to shoot oh, the first ship is passing really close by right now I need to turn around uh, okay 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 let me think let me think here this isn't good um, I need to turn to the opposite direction kind of Missing my opportunity. I let them get too close before I took action. Would your midships, please? Alright. Let's see what we can see. Yeah, see, they're passing me right now. Oh, look at those babies. Alright, I need to be quick. This might not be a complete disaster. Let's see if we can identify one of these guys very quickly and then work out their speed. Angle on bow is pretty easy to work out. No. No. I think that's what you are. I think you're a well factory ship. Yeah, pretty certain that's what this is. And that's a big prize. Okay, so if we quickly do a speed check here, where's the bow of this thing? It's about here. No, 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 no. It's here. I thought that was the ship behind it. Let's put the periscope down a little bit. This, one's, this convoy seems to be a little bit slightly defended. Only two escorts. I guess they're probably not expecting many U-boats in the Gulf of Oman. See, we're already past zero degrees, so they're passing me. Um, which is, as I say, not ideal, but... I might still be able to get some good shots off here. Let me get my notes here. I've forgotten, obviously, how to do the whole TDC thingy. And the stern is just passing now. So that's 39 seconds. 
uh, speed, central scope, time along the sheet, blah, 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 line up the time on the mid outer dial, 39. Here, the ship length, which is 167, which is about, I don't know, about here ish. Uh, speed is shown at red mark on left. Eight knots, I think that sounds about right to me. Eight knots, there we go. Distance is very close, angle on bow. They're moving away from me now. So they're looking out to my sort of left of me. They're going to be like around here somewhere. Okay. This is a kind of a snap solution, but I think it's fairly good. Uh, then what do we have here? Uh, depth. Go for 11 for this one here. I need to be quick. By one. By two. Looks like a nice tanker over here as well. Uh, this one I'll do impact, I think. So I'm not sure what the. Uh, depth of the bow is. And fire four. Okay. Let's start diving and turning away. All right then, I'm not sure how these will do really. I could have aimed for this guy as well, I suppose, but never mind. Um, we're very close, so if there are going to be any hits, I'd expect them to have already occurred really, but who knows. Oh shit, I think I did the angle on bow completely wrong. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Crap, 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 crap. They were looking to my right, not to the left. Oh, how stupid can you be? Fuck sticks. Okay, my only hope now is to use my stern torpedoes. I'm going to speed up a bit. That was stupid. That's what you get when you don't play for ages. Makes silly mistakes. Verdammt! God damn it, I should have done uh, this side here. Because they're looking to the right, not to the left. God damn it. You've got to imagine that you're on the enemy ship and they're looking at you. So in which direction would they look to see you? And I got it completely wrong, the opposite way around. So these torpedoes have no hope of hitting anything, I don't think. So my only hope now is to, well, I can, what I can do, rather than trying to rush and take a stern shot here, which is probably not going to hit it either, uh, I think the best thing to do would be to slip away and stalk this convoy, reload the torpedoes, and try again. That's probably the sensible thing to do. So that is what I shall do. I'll go down to about 40 meters just in case. Alright, let's speed things up a little bit. Not been detected, I don't think, so that's fine. Now, visibility is very good, so I need to. Where's the compass? Is this a compass? Yes. To get to around 20 kilometers away. How close is this guy here? Still very close. Uh, increase time compression, that might help. He 
he's now moving away. We should be good to increase speed now. We can hopefully surface fairly soon. Okay, well, I'm going to try and maneuver in front of this convoy again, off camera, and I'll come back if I'm successful.